Hello users, today we're going to learn how to install Yosemite from scratch, the new system for the Mac. With this method, you don't need to replace your system. Well, it's super easy, just two steps, and here we go! Welcome to the Mac Super User Tutorial. First, we need to download the Yosemite application for the installation free from apple.com. Just click here and then choose Upgrade Now. Now in the page of Yosemite, click View in Mac App Store. Once in App Store, just click Download. We can also share it from here to the Facebook, Twitter, etc. Now, we need to log with our Apple ID. Just put your username and password and continue. We can monitor the download in the section of the downloaded applications here. Meanwhile, we're gonna go to DiscMakerX.com and we are going to download the last version of this application which is 4 Beta 4. When the Yosemite download is ready will be available in our applications folder and will start automatically but just dismiss it and close it. Well, open the DMG Drag the DiscMaker X application to your Applications folder. Double click to start. Now insert the USB drive, pen drive or external hard disk you're going to use in this process. I'm gonna use an external hard drive I already named Yosemite. Now, select here Yosemite 10.10 .10 and click Use this copy. Now, if you have a thumb drive or USB memory at least with 8 gigabytes of space, you can choose this option. I'm gonna use an external hard drive and we'll choose this one, another kind of disk. Now choose the name of your drive. In this case, Yosemite. Continue and then read the warnings. You will be destroying all your data and continue. The drive will be formatted and prepared. Now our administration password is required. Write it down and click OK. While the process begins, you will need to wait 16 minutes or less and several windows will pop up with the contents created. This is the aspect of the new Yosemite install disk. This will be the name of the new bootable unit or bootable drive. Now, when all is finished, this window will come and we're going to select this option, Open Startup Preferences. Here, you will wanna select the Yosemite install disk, but in this case is not present. Don't worry, if it's not present, we can always choose the correct drive when we restart the Mac, pressing the Alt key or Option key just after the Mac startup sound. If this Yosemite install disk is present in these options, select it and then Restart the Mac. You can use this button right here. 
to start the installation process. Well, let's go to the installation process.